welcome to the 5th Royalty Soapy Awards, coming to you from Johannesburg.
And now, please welcome your host for this evening, Felix Thorpe and film and television actress, Enke Mbali Mlojwa. and welcome to the fifth annual Royalty Soapy Awards. This is where we recognize all the major contributors to the South African daily TV drama. It is my greatest pleasure to be your host this evening um, alongside the very beautiful and talented actress and also a philanthropist. Please give it up for Antle Mbali Mlojwa. Thank you, Felix. Please give it up for Felix. <laughs> You know, it's actually lovely to see that the lights are on tonight, huh? Mm. Love and light. Love and light. But the show must go on. And it's <laughs> too soon, I hear. <laughs> and it's absolutely wonderful to be sharing the stage with you too, Felix. Um, it's incredible to celebrate the multi-talented Rutabila, whose performance was absolutely amazing, right? Indeed. Yes, she deserves all of that. It is indeed an honor to be celebrating South Africa's sensational stars of the small screen, stars like myself and my peers. Every single week, we bring the magic to everyone's lives and make everyone's lives just a little richer. Indeed. And please note that for tonight's ceremony, strict COVID-19 regulations and social distancing practices have been adhered to for the awards. <laughs> Absolutely. This is a safe space to recognize everyone who plays a part in the industry, from performers to technical teams, the producers, makeup artists, costume editors, casting directors, and cinematographers. We celebrate your talent, and we thank you for bringing shine into our lives. Celebrating our shine is the theme of this year's awards. Our daily dramas are something we look forward to at the end of each day. And if this unprecedented events of the pandemic have shown us anything, it is that people need people. We need our connections. We need to hear each other's stories. When in lockdown or adhering to curfew, there has been one trusty source of entertainment, right? Our TV stars and Soaps Daily have continued to deliver fire during this extremely difficult time. Indeed, never wavering on outstanding quality, they were a beacon of hope during the dark times. And we thank everyone involved in this industry for continuing to provide excellence in the face of adversity. And I think that deserves a big warm round of applause. So, Felix, what do you think celebrating the shine means? Don't answer. I'll do that for you. <laughs> <laughs> for centuries, performers, writers, and directors have been iconic part of history and humanity, telling stories of love, strategy, inspiring us on a daily basis. Tonight, the Royal Soapy Awards pay tribute to a variety of daily dramas, soaps that shun a light in the impact of our lives. Indeed. The Royalty Sophie Awards continue to grow in prestige uh, with the addition of six new categories. Outstanding casting, young performer, cinematography, sound mixing and editing, and two new viewer choice uh, categories. Uh, the Viewer's Choice of Best Actor and Actress Awards. And one of my favorite new categories is the Young Performers Award. It acknowledges, yes, I think it deserves a round of applause. It does. <laughs> It's basically an acknowledgement of youth in industry. They must just start out and they have an impact. Let me say that again. They have just started out yes. and they have an impact. <laughs> And over the course of last month, the Royalty Sophie Awards had the opportunity to sit down with the 2021 nominees uh, to chat about their careers and life in the industry. Uh, this series of talks known as Insight uh, creates a deeper conversation around the industry. Yes, and one of the objectives of the Royal Sophie Awards is to raise the profile of artists in the industry to shine a light on exceptional talent that we have in South Africa throughout the evening you will hear the extracts from these conversations before each category. All righty then, so let's kick it off with the Technical Awards. Welcome, today's just gonna be a, a, a conversation, just chatting and talking about the industry, and I look forward to really chatting to you guys because you all work in different parts of the industry, but all of us in the industry. 
Ooh, wow. Rose amongst the thorns. <laughs> I woke okay. up in English half of the class this morning, so... I would like to call, I would say, all DOPs, magic creators. Ah! We sweep, we paint, we drive. But you then, as a DOP, you need to make sure that what people see on TV excites them. If you take a car, we pretty much like the steering wheel. We don't really do a lot of work, but if it fails, it's the steering wheel that goes first, you know. Mm. That's not really the world how we interpret it and you're saying these people are supposed to be like the Tzotzi or you're saying you know what I mean but the Tzotzi speaking English I don't understand that's not reality and that's that's not going to sell internationally it's not going to even entertain the people because when they're watching it they want to see themselves I can read cars but I need my song <laughs> good evening everyone the role of an editing team cannot be underestimated Editors make us performers look good. They weave their magic as they edit our less favorable moments and work with the director to create the best performance and story. Here are the nominees for Outstanding Editing Team. Seven Delan. Say dear, puzzle up. You think for me, you can my stop. Deep City. Skim Sam. The estate. Oh, I can imagine. And then when I'm on Jan, how did the viewing go? The queen. To view. And Upetina Way. Last to. but not least, number three, Nubia. And the winner is. The Queen. The Sun Bonani, Inijani, um, Sapila, um, Ish. I don't know what to say. I'm an editor. I don't usually do this. <laughs> Um, but thank you to everyone. Um, without him, this wouldn't be possible. I would like to thank the team back at Ferguson, who is Zika Bonus, who's our colorist, Ule Rato Lehuku, our subtitler, U Patrick, my fellow editor. I would like to thank the team as well back at Ferguson for the amazing footage they give us all the time. And... Um, Lastly, I'd like to thank Ukoni, man. Um, this is for you. This is for our boss who left us. And, um, yeah, man, the show will go on. Thank you. The next technical award is for outstanding sound mixing and editing. This involves capturing the audio on set, mixing and balancing the sound as it is recorded. As well as solving any problems around background noise and distortion, let's not forget audio also provides atmosphere, tension and enhances the actor's performance. And here are the nominees. Orange play. Deep City. Gathrot mit Rugby. Sound and action. Imbe. Saint Worcester. And the estate. And the winner is... Getrout met Rugby. Okay, I'm going to go. Thank you to my team, uh, Spe and Bonani, and Leon and Final Mix, Production, um, Overpack, Productions, and the whole crew in Trust. Trust. Shop.
Thank you, Gigi and Kamo. And now, outstanding lighting and cinematography uh, to present these awards. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome the star of Isitembiso and Scandal, Sanile Mashangu, and also the star of House of Zwite, Lois Duplessis. It is our pleasure to announce the, the award for the most outstanding lighting direction. And quite simply, I'm sure you all would agree, is that we would literally be left in the dark if it wasn't for this technical team, right? I mean, literally. We'd all agree that lighting adds atmosphere and ambience. And ladies, it makes us look good, right? Here are the nominees. <laughs> Seven Dilan. No. Lawrence Flay. Debra's Diesel. Deep City. Isolo. The Estate. And Upetina Way to. And the winner is. Upetina Way to. Good evening. I'm very nervous. <laughs> We're the new baby on screen at the moment. But um, I'm receiving this award on behalf of our team, Dino Benedetti, leading us. Um, I was very proud of this department. We had more women running this department than men. And I think that's something to be proud of. I'd like to thank our company, Nona Sources Entertainment, and the entire production team. Good luck to everyone for tonight. The nominees for Outstanding Cinematography all come from diverse backgrounds, but they have one thing in common. They are masters behind the camera. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> and the nominees are? Arwen's Flay. Dip City Imbe The Estate The Queen Why? And open it in a way. And I'm going to open my Bible. Thanks, I'm sorry for lying. Mama's boy. And the winner is. Imbe! Uh, yeah, yeah, but yeah, really, I would like to thank the men above for their abilities, the gifts, and the talent that they have blessed me with. I would like to thank all my EPs. There's quite a few of them. I cannot name them. Sharon, Lynn, Kanye, thank you for trusting me with your picture. Gash in Kalumengenyao. Thank you for stealing all my lunchtime and my weekends, talking creativity. Vivek, and the guys that we left behind, you guys keep me on my toes. Thank you very much. Thanks to everyone that watches the show, and thank you to the organizers of the hours. Thank you very much. A big congratulations to our winners of the Technical Awards so far. And to present the awards for Outstanding Art Direction, Outstanding Direction Team are two powerhouse performers who have left their mark on the stage and the screen. Please give it up for Lungam Fukeng and Ziko Nazodaga. You buy say ladies outside of your lounge room. So, it is an honor to recognize those artists who create our television world, the art directors. 
Art directors are responsible for the visual style of a production. We instantly recognize Opikopi in Sevendaland or the Pagatwayo home in Echelon Estate. Yeah. <laughs> and it's all because of the work of the art director. This is so true. Here are the talented nominees for outstanding art direction. Seven Delan. Binnenlanders. Getroft mm, like mit Rugby. In Bain. Seitz Oster. And the estate. And the winner is. We used to being behind the camera, not in front. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Thanks to the Royalty Sophie Awards. This means a lot to us. It's been a tough year. I'd like to thank my team. I have the most awesome team, incredibly dedicated. Thank their families. They have to put up with us with our long hours and our difficult moods. And I'd love to dedicate this to the people we lost this year and that we love them. Thanks, guys. Okay, so we swiftly move on. An actor's great support comes from their director. Directors hold the whole story in their heads. They guide us when it comes to choices that we make in our performances. And they are ultimately responsible for how the narrative is told. And here are the nominees for the Outstanding Directing Team. Orange Flay. <laughs> Deep City. <laughs> Imbe. Isolo. <laughs> the Estate. <laughs> and the Queen. I want to know why, after all the years of doing business, and the winner is... Oh my God! Deep City! Guys, thank you to everyone who tunes in and supports. Thank you to the cars. Thank you to Manda. Thank you to Emne. Thank you for this opportunity. I just want to say one thing. From receptionist to continuity to director and creative to producer. Dreams are real, guys. Chase them. I am so proud to be part of this dynamic industry. Congratulations to all of the winners in our technical categories. Still to come, we continue with the Royalty Sophie Awards 2021 Technical and Creative Categories. Stay tuned for more stars, more magic, more shine, more 5th Royalty Sophie Awards. Still to come, we continue with more winners celebrated in the Royalty Sophie Awards 2021 Creative Categories. Stay tuned. To present the final technical award for outstanding casting director, please welcome on stage the House of Sweden star, Kaya Dada. I was Krimani. Come on now, it's level two. We are dressed up and get kicked in the cheese.
No, guys, not chabula, guys. Nothing not bad. All right, ask Kali any manch. Fellow South Africans. <laughs> so this is so hectic. Although a car says the president will be the role. Basically, Kufunagala outstanding casting. Putting together an outstanding cast to match characters is one important thing. Gilana to say these are the nominees for outstanding cast. Binalandus. What's wrong with you people? Do you want me to kill? Uh, Deep uh, City. Imbale. I I saw no. I I and that is Mr. Buck's while. Ladies and gentlemen, outstanding cast goes to Deep City! Thank you so much, Um It's one thing to cast characters, it's another thing for those people to bring the characters alive. This is for you, the entire cast. Win or lose today, your stars, your champions, the entire crew, my partner, Umanda, who's backstage. This is still a four-month-old baby, guys, at Deep City. We appreciate the love, we appreciate the support. Everybody, the crew, the EPs, everybody on the show, thank you, Siabonga. Africa, Tsoha. Wow. Melanie, you're supposed to say Tsoha. Girl, I understand you. It means Africa rise. Oh, she got it. She got it. We won't be in it. As somebody whose life and business revolve around the beauty industry, it gives me great pleasure to present the award for outstanding makeup and hairstyling. And for somebody who never wants to be in front of the camera without sitting in the makeup chair first. <laughs> and in Kulmela Mina. I am very proud and happy to be presenting this next award. The nominees are... Deep City. <laughs> Gomorrah Season 2. Kamola. Imbewu. Our bodies, we need to embrace Isono. <laughs> Mubango <laughs> and the estate. I mean, I'm deal. Okay. I'm a done deal. I mean, and the winner is Gamora season two. Thank you so much. <laughs> okay, this is my first time getting an award, but um, I would like to thank my team. It wasn't easy, like with COVID and everything, but we managed to stay in our lane and everything. Thank you to our producers, Tavang Kutluano Lien, and uh, thank you to Lulu also and Janine. Thank you. <laughs> The wardrobe department helps to select, design, and make the costumes for all performers. Their job is to add authenticity through wardrobe, as well as to give us major wardrobe envy. The nominees for Outstanding Wardrobe Teams are... Deep City. <laughs> Business Lab. Gomorrah Season 2. <laughs> Scandal. Saint Worcester, the estate, and the queen.
And the winner is the estate. <laughs> Beautiful was that? Man, that was just too beautiful. And uh, now, continuing with the Creative Awards, it's now time to shine the spotlight on the writers. Without the written word, there is no storyline. There is no spicy dialogue for the actors, no climax, no drama. Because of all of this, and it begins with the writer's imagination. And now let us hear from some of South Africa's most respected writers. It's either you are a writer or you're not. Mm. It, that's, that's just how it starts. I loved reading, I loved stories, you know. And I didn't know then that there would be any writing or anything like that. But mm. it was the love of story more than, I guess, the love of words as well. Yeah, I loved reading and um, watching films and escaping. So there's a lot of asking questions. What is this about? Where are we going? You know, how long are we, you know? If you're a storyteller, it's in you. No matter if you went to school, no matter if um, you passed English or didn't pass English. Storytelling is something that is in you and it's so important. All you wanna do is just tell stories because that's who you are. Mm. And to present the award for our standing writing team, please make some noise for the funniest woman I know. Uh, she's uh, South Africa's first lady of comedy. And that is the amazing Dumi Moraki. Dumi Lang, Dumi Lang. Just to clarify the rumors, I don't live in America, I'm here. I would also like to say thank you to the Royalty Soapy Awards for letting us get out of our pyjamas and bath and see people. Thank you so much. Thank you. Whew, I was tired of sunlight and Vaseline. And a big shout out to the writers of South African TV right now. That's, you guys don't understand. You got us through lockdown. Now, I also want to say holla back at all the TV addicts out there. I'm not judging, even me, I'm an addict. You've met our writers. Um, we can't get enough of our daily dramas. And Mbali is right, guys. All the juicy plot twists and the conflict begins with the writing team. And here are the nominees for Outstanding Writing Team. Deep City. Gomorrah Season 2. Imbeu. Scheme Sam. Sweet Oster. And The Estate. That's it. This is the group of death. Yo! Yo! I could tell Skurafku. And the winner is The Estate! As you can see, I'm not used to the stage, so I need the support of uh, to me here. Thank you so much to um, the Royalty Soap Awards. Um, I don't even know where to, where to start. Like, 
The writers are the engine of everything that we see on screen, and I want to dedicate this to our amazing, amazing team, Bongi Ndabas, Bongi Lenkosana, Tony Miambo, and so many others that make this thing so magical. Thank you so much. Thank you, SABC. Thank you, everyone. Still to come, an exclusive performance by Vusi Nova. Plus, more winners celebrated in the Royalty Soapy Awards 2021 Creative Categories. Stay tuned. Welcome back to the fifth Royal Soapy Awards. We are here celebrating the shine of the television stars that have brought our lives into light. They say that stars shine really brightly in Africa. And do we have a major star here tonight? His music career is a huge one. I could consider him to be royalty. He's a multi-award winning musician, vocalist, and he's one of South Africa's most famous musicians by far. Please stand up for me for my favorite artist, Vusinova.
Thank you, Fusi. That was indeed incredible. Another big warm round of applause. Yeah. And now to present the award for outstanding newcomer, please welcome the patron of the Royalty Soapy Foundation Youth Development Program. His name is Mr. Silongubani, otherwise affectionately known as Mr. O82. <laughs> And alongside one of South Africa's rising stars, Nomvelo Makanya. Sani Bonani, Nazenaba Tepsu. Well, my name is Silongubane uh, from Le Msinga, Ngamba Nemkawa Wamla. Well, uh, it's my great pleasure to be here tonight. Recognizing the newcomers to the industry. Um, Kaya, I'm just a businessman, not in the industry. Mm -hmm. But um, my passion is to give a, a young people a helping hand. I definitely agree. I've also been in the industry. Hi, Bo. Why can't you? I'm going to go to the industry. I've also been in the industry for about nine years now, and it's, a, it's really great seeing platforms like the Royalty Soapy Awards giving newcomers a chance to be recognized within the industry. Here are the nominees for the outstanding newcomer. Chat by SK Lib, Arwen's Flay. <laughs> Chris Pignati as Charleston Nube in Deep City. Nompumelelo Vilagazi as Nequana in Deep City. Lebo Hangumpiana as Kalina Maponia in Deep City. Luyanda Shezi as Lungi Lejele in Deep City. Na Ama Eli Sumai as Omar Rabia, Sud Oyster. Are your explanations? And the winner is... We're definitely bringing this one home. Nambumalela Villagazi and Snagwala on Deep City! Thank you to Uput Manja. Thank you to our fellow cast, Abante Suganaba, from the Instagram Live to the big screen. I absolutely love that. From the Instagram Live to the big screen. Now, as we all know, it's pretty hard to get into the industry when you're an unknown, and the Royal Soapy Awards shine light onto those who find it hard onto. And the two people I'm about to introduce are just that. Nom Vulam Kaya and Nefi Sam Kabela. Come on stage. Sanbona. <laughs> Nefi, you look so beautiful, by the way. Uh, hello. <laughs> Um, so, young performers bring the energy and the enthusiasm of the youth to a set. Mm -hmm. They also bring their hopes and aspirations. Now tonight, we acknowledge the talent of these nominees. Though they are young, they have already established themselves as powerful entertainers. <laughs> and now, the nominees are... Caden Bauer okay. as Ruan De Pia in Binnelander. I see stupid stuff of full of Roxanne Burman as Vicky De Beer in Binnelanders. Tiamo Mulobi as Musiso in Deep City. Titebu Holi Twaba as Mbali in Generations The Legacy. Something about Mamluz. They found a body. Eye Tumkwanazi as Mepombengu in Imbe. 
and Bathe Tsepo Hadebe as Peño Mubape in The Estate. And the winner is... Double for the drama as Bali in generation. Hey, All right, okay, I give it to you. Akawa, uh, thank you so much. I am so, I am so incredibly grateful. Firstly, shout out to God. Okay, thank you, God. Thank you to my parents. Thank you to my family, my friends. Thank you to Generations for giving me this opportunity. Come on, come on. Thank you to the people who fell in love with Mbali. I am super, super, super grateful. Denzel Washington, I'm coming, ne? Sure. Congratulations to all of the winners and now to present the next award, that of uh, the most outstanding couple. Please welcome on stage two of the most attractive actors on TV, Kanyam Kangisa and Cedric Bori. Good evening ladies and gents, you all look absolutely beautiful tonight. Now, Cedric, I see it fit that you and I are presenting Outstanding Couple tonight because we kind of look at it, don't you think? Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, right? I don't know about you guys, but I strongly <laughs> agree. Now, these are the couples that we're so desperate to see them get back together, but there's always something or someone keeping them apart. Yeah, I mean, one minute they're in love, then they're breaking up to make up. We can't exactly keep up, <laughs> kind of like the gentleman I was sitting next to tonight. Yeah, well. <laughs> <laughs> Talk about toxic cycles. These, guys, it's scripted. <laughs> Carry on. These are the couples that we cannot get enough of, by the way. Here are the nominees. Clayton Everston and Jolene Martin as Detective Clint Smith, AKA Jake and Beatrice Abrahams. Aaron's Flay. Jokes. <laughs> Gemant Gelden Hayes and Gianni Swigela as Louis Costa and Naomi Costa, Binnenlanders. I can't even love you. And no Zugo Naiyane as Herbert and Knox in Deep City. In Berlin, Angas and Jenga are not going to be able Zolisa Kaluva and Tembisete as Melu Sithlamini and Gladys Sithlamini in Gomorrah Season 2. Good house, I'm fulfilling my Tatsinia and I feel like I'm going to sit in Tom Sibiti. Sidney Ramakuela and Litebo Homolise as Mulalo and Teboho in Mubango. Police station, won't be so when I come on this Parijaka Kanaka at some police station. Police station! And Stumum Chali and Joanne Rainica as Muzi Pagatwayo and Luante Pagatwayo, the estate. Baby, we have been without money before, and you found a way out. And the winner is. Zolisa Kaluba and Tembi Siete, Gamora Season 2. We ask for the glow, we ask for the performance, we ask for braveness on screen, on stage, and he says, I'm listening to you, Tay Tay. Here's the blessing. Thank you, Father. Thank you to my family, Sibukeng, Bao Triangle, Kaufela Luna, Kosowe to Kaufela Luna, Kelly Lebua. Thanks to my friends, social media, the viewers. If it weren't of you guys, I wouldn't be here, wouldn't be here. My on screen husband, Zolisa Kaluva. Yes, we fight. Yes, we're both passionate. Yes, we love performing. Luena, Gomara Gomorini, thank you.
thank you so much Chabang, Lulu, uh, Kutuano, Mulefes, Jaminis, my son, Zotwa, Skafe, Lakalilebua, Shona. Look at me now. Still to come, a performance by Makazi, plus more winners celebrated in the Royalty Soapy Awards 2021 supporting role categories. Stay tuned. Welcome back to the fifth Royalty Soapy Awards. Television royalty is in the house tonight. More kings and queens from the small screen are here to be crowned tonight. We adored him, seriously single, and we loved her in Rockville. Please make some noise for Tabo Malema and Tuli Pongolo. <laughs> Hello, everyone. <laughs> now, supporting actors are known to own the scene. I didn't want to say shine in the scene, own the scene. And although they may have supporting roles, they really do bring out the best of them and they keep us wanting more. <laughs> All right, all right, all right, back to the business. These nominees for those outstanding supporting actors have given us unforgettable performances. Chester. And the nominees are... Emmanuel Costas as Sergio De Freitas in Binnen Landers. Fine, this for the bay, I got in the results, so back off. Zikaise Makroti as Fistos, Deep City. <laughs> Senzo Gushe Hatebe as Abed Niko Kumete is Wayne Van Royen as Tokis in Scandal. They can't fire you for helping the law. Can they do that? Matli Maupela as Lesiba Mulife in The Estate. Tell me that you dream home. I forbid it. Well, I won't do that. And Sparky Kulu as Sia Pagatwayo in The Estate. I didn't even like bread. Um, and the winner is... Emmanuel Castiz and Sergio de Freitas in Benelander. Who can I fear? I did put a bliss for. Who can I live so much? I did do it. Who can I heart what a long call for trappers? They're great for. I did know it. Covid protocol. Wow, this is so unexpected. Thank you so much. Um, and of course, the supporting actor is not only as good as his uh, leading leading partners. And uh, Cara Dutoy, thank you very much. And I have to dedicate this to one of my scene partners, the late great Ben Creer. Thank you so much. A man, a man who I—he's the type of man who someone would wish they could spend more time with. God rest his soul, and thank you so much to Stark and Benelanders. Thank you very much. The nominees for Outstanding Supporting Actresses are a mix of younger and much more experienced actresses, but they all have the same thing in common. They're all just brilliant. That's far. And every one of these actresses has given nuanced and complex performances. And here are the nominees. <laughs> Juanita Adams okay. as Leticia in Aaron's Flay. Vele Menenge as Maureen Cadeza in Deep City. Maureen, the bed is serene when there are couch here. We'll see you out. Melissa Massein as Evonne K. Nessie Grissel in Gertrude Met Rugby. Elizabeth Serunye as principal in Scheme Sam. Nadia Vovkins as Suzanne Leroux in The Estate. 
and Linda Sebezo as Goniwe Pagatwayo in The Estate. The winner is... Elizabeth Srunya as principal in Skinso! lady boss who believe in this talent the supporters Truly cast our fellow Peu Gallebo. Congratulations once again to all of our winners, and now I am so excited to introduce the next performer. Please give it up for the unstoppable talent that is Makaze! To come, Mafigi Zolo plus more winners celebrated in the Royalty Soapy Awards 2021 Viewers' Choice categories. Stay tuned. Yet again to the Mzansi's fifth royalty Soapy Awards. Tonight we are honoring the phenomenal talent of South Africa's best technical and creative teams. Now you can woo. <laughs> <laughs> we know that those who speak the loudest are the fans. Indeed, and that is why the Soapies are pleased to announce the Viewer's Choice uh, Most Popular Show of the Year Award. Uh, this is where you, the public, have the opportunity uh, to have your say about your favorite daily show. Joining us tonight is one of the viewers who voted for their favorite show, 
Welcome, Pumele Lambuto. Are you good? How are you feeling? <sighs> I'm excited. You excited? Yeah. I can imagine. It must be like a dream watching the stars on TV and now you're here with them. Right? Yeah. I must say you came to slay. Oh my gosh, thanks God. Yes. Well, how beautiful is she tonight? <laughs> And we've opened the votes to the public because they are your biggest fans. And to be completely transparent, uh, we will reveal the third, second, and first place winner with the number of votes recorded for each. In third place, with 223 votes, Gomorra season two! Yeah. <laughs> and in second place, with 326 votes, the Queen! The Viewer's Choice, most popular show in first place with 444 votes, voted by South Africa. And the winner is... Skipsa! Staging. Hello everyone, congratulations to all the nominees. Thank you to all the voters. Thank you, Royalty Awards. Uh, it all started with three boys telling a story and a man dying, and now we are 11 years old. This, yes, <laughs> this is a big thank you to everyone that has started with us on this journey from day one, and here we are. Thank you so much. This is not for us, this is not ours, yeah. this is definitely yours. Thank you, South Africa. Congratulations to Skim Sam. <laughs> Your fans have roared their approval. And we continue with the Viewers' Choice Awards for Best Actor and Best Actress. And to present these, please give a warm welcome to our next presenters, Leseri FM's Tabo Mokone. And we can't get enough of her as No Monde on the River. Please welcome Linda Toba. <laughs> I've missed this so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> there are no daily shows without the love from their fans. These passionate viewers tune in every night to watch their favorite actors. And we are Mobile the ultimate winner. 1,665 votes. South Africa, your best nominated actor is. Don 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 don. Crispin Yati! Dipsy, I <laughs> Listen, uh, I just want to thank uh, God, the Almighty, the one that's seated on the throne of Kala, for giving us this platform. From Instagram Live to here. Perfect. This is amazing. I want to thank Zimbabwe. I want to thank South Africa. Zumelu <laughs> 
Zama Zubaba Wazo. Thank you very much. Thank you, Zimbabwe. I love you. Andrew Pela. And Harsha Bohore, the public, Ikraunile Mang, Joloka, their favorite actress. South Africa, your ultimate best actress, got 5,294 votes. Locha <laughs> <laughs> And the rest of the cast, thank you very much for this golden opportunity. Thank you for believing in me. Imagine Instagram, Mara, today I am. Thank you. And thank you uh, to the public for casting your votes and also taking part in tonight's celebrations. And now it's time for me to call on to the stage the most iconic musical duo and the most enduring duo in South African music. Please raise the roof, scream and shout, put your hands together for Mafigi Zola!
Still to come, more winners and our Lifetime Achiever celebrated on the Royalty Soapy Awards 2021. Stay tuned. Welcome back to SABC One, the home of the Royalty Soapy Awards. And we hope that you are celebrating at home the wins of all your favorite performers and daily dramas. South Africans know how to celebrate. We know how to throw a party. And now it gives me great pleasure to introduce to you the lady that is in charge of this party tonight. She's the founder of the Royalty Soapy Awards, actress, businesswoman, and philanthropist. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Winnie Nchaba. Thank you so much, Felix, for that warm welcome. And good evening to everyone who is watching the fifth, hey, the fifth Royalty Sophie Awards. I couldn't be more prouder of what our industry has achieved. I mean, in spite of the many obstacles that we are facing, we have not only survived, but we keep on thriving. Tonight is a celebration of that, and also a recognition of the resilience of artists. As artists, we are an incredible group of people. We are passionate, we are enthusiastic. I mean, if we have to tell a story, we will tell it. Whether we are writers, producers, directors, performers, we want to, and we need to share our light with the world. I'm proud, Minaba Winnie Lenjaba, to call myself an artist. How about you? <laughs> you know, many people have asked me why I started the Royalty Sophie Awards. Of course, it was about honoring those who had done exceptional work on TV. But also, I had a bigger picture in mind. The Royal Tisopi Awards has started a social responsibility program, the Royal Tisopi Foundation, which has been developed to guide and support young people's career aspirations in the performing and creative arts industry. Just last week, myself and three fellow acting colleagues, together with our youth program partners, Asanda Nati Consultants, who are here with us this evening, we traveled to Greytown and Moy River where we met and spoke with the most remarkable and dynamic youths whose dream is to one day make it big in our industry. The Royal Tisopi Foundation was thrilled to provide the opportunity for the 10 of these youths which were brought here in Joburg where they spent the whole day working with our production team and learning about the different disciplines within our industry. And tonight, ladies and gentlemen, five of them are actually here and they are working. You can see them wearing uh, black t-shirts. They are running up and down. <laughs> I see you. I see you. This is an experience that they will never forget. And neither will I. We really are very proud of the work that we're putting for, for, for this program. And we still have so much to do. So one other uh, uh, foundation's program that we have uh, started doing is called the Insight. I'm sure you have seen the snippets of different uh, people working in the industry, talking. This is, this is a platform for everyone in our industry to tell their stories and share and give us a deeper understanding of the things that go on behind the scenes and even in front of the camera. It broke my heart when I heard one actress saying, they are in the right industry, but in a wrong country. We still have a long way to go as artists. So Insight is a platform that gives artists, creatives, a chance to come and talk. Let's work together and build our industry. You have seen snippets with writers, with directors, with producers, let's take this opportunity and use that. We are using key industry players in this industry. 
It's about having a deeper conversation about what matters in the arts and gaining a deeper understanding about the work that we all love. I am a firm believer that if you can dream it, you can achieve it. <laughs> so I look forward to being a part of growing the TV and arts industry, fostering star quality, because we are about fostering star quality. Thank you to all the artists and the public for your continued support of the Royal SOP Foundation and the Royal SOP Awards. Enjoy the rest of the show. Good evening. Trailblazers, because I've grown up watching some of you. I've grown up watching some of your content. I didn't stay in school much. I didn't know why we went to school in the first place, except just getting beaten. So I left very early. When? When was early? <laughs> I'm not those behind the scenes people who are shy about being, you know, I just love everything about it. I was 17. It was the kind of movie that just like ticked all the boxes for me. My late grandmother was an amateur actress oh. and a comedian. Yeah, and I walked out of there and I thought, to hell, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to make movies. She was um, very, she was actually, um, Dr. Lillian reminds me of her, <laughs> very boisterous. And I used to go watch her doing these um, amateur shows and I thought that's what I want to do, I want to act. That was a look at some of the prolific trailblazers in the arts industry. I can't wait to catch episodes and insight. It looks amazing. I don't know what you guys think, but I think it's mwah. Our next award is Social Cohesion and Recognition Award. To present this is the vibrant, energetic, and go-getter Motswedding FM's LTK. Good evening. The Social Cohesion Award is a unique award. telenovelas. mainstream media. The recipient of this award is a program. Does that, that does not shy away from the responsibility of raising awareness. Most importantly, the recipient of this award, Orefa Matsetele Matsetele, Guahor Bonsa, or Africa Borua, a corner who kitan, I will a corner who did a moho. Me, Kilebakaleo, Lahore. The Social Cohesion Recognition Award in a way, Said Austin. Uh, hi, everybody. San Bonan. Uh, oh, Molin here. I am, oh, uh, I am honored to receive this on behalf of the team of Sage Oyster as one of the founding producers of the show all the way in Cape Town. Um, as a writing team, we endeavor to start a conversation, highlight an issue or polemic, and also depict how many social issues are more, new and are more nuanced than just being right or wrong. Uh, thank you so much for this award and for the team, Colin Bradley at Gambit Films, uh, Homebrew Films, and Sage Oyster Films. Siabong, I don't know. Have a good night. Thank you. Congratulations to Said Oster. Hope I said it right. And uh, every community has a character which is innocently recognizable as being part of the show. Background actors are needed to contribute to a production. Their roles may be small, but still they make an impact. The recipient of this award is the most deserving because of his growth and commitment to his growth, to his role. Congratulations to Temba Christopher Sibanyoni as Danger from Deep City.
black brain pictures ekhaya ngibonga uNkulunkulu ngibonga basekhaya ngibonge nina masapota eqineni ngathi strama of nomgabade nomkhabudek together ne skin trend i style like ite gasel twere axis nine keep watching i will give you what to entertain This next award is one of the most prestigious. The Lifetime Achievement Award is presented to a person in the arts industry for consistency and extraordinary achievement throughout their career. Dr. Ngovich. From a TGM, from a domestic servant, from anything you can think of, to doctor, and with the order of the commander from the president. If I don't go to work and don't do it, I don't do my contract. So I'm sorry, you have yourself to blame. And you go and employ a lawyer. When you are not employees, CCMP has got nothing to do with you. You were all stupid. I am so honored to be recognized as a legend tonight. Lillian Dube has been an inspiration to many of us for many years. She started her acting career in the 1980s and excelled because she was able to play drama, comedy, film, TV, everything. <laughs> Everybody has their favorite Lillian Dube performance. Hers was hers, but Mama Lillian, we love you so much. Please do come up on stage. Kukupaliki <laughs> Kia le bua le ka dula fatsi. O bana ke tlo bua o ra go ra ka fela. A ke tse bo re ke thabele award e because na ke bonne ka re ke nepotism. O bana e no ke my granddaughter. Winnie is my daughter. Sophie is my daughter. All of you are my children. Le ho le se tla saka, no tla saka, tla saka. Ka fela lona. So, Kabila, like a home decision, a key tabbing, give at a hurry. Haki Aki Rekang, setting Aki Utri, was one fourteen little woman, Akiba Utri, gets about fellow Remudimukil Rat. A shopper Mazos cuts off on Mudimu Kilirato. Rata, Murana Mudimu, how Capuliosa, how Kamaya was there. Wabu bedi mula o otana lona rata wa he nu jolo ka hawita har ne raka raphela ka le rato leo ho no tla bangona ti that is why mona who show biz ho le munati ba ne retsa ntwe re ratang re aratana ha o hlanya ko hana ha o fumana msebetsi ke mo ho le munati a ke wa tlo le sengetsana ko ke wa tlafela ho le bua morana modimo hore jolo ka ngwana no aka luna mona le go la leng tseba ke le tseba go le ke thabela re ka je ko ke director ke ba ba mbalone ene ka je ko ke ithuta ho ho ngata ho lona bana jwa le ke a le bua ho bana a never ke tla ke tswa fashioning ka baka la lona jwa le ke tla se khoeng ha nka ka se puta ha ona msebetsi ne ntse ke sa skolomi anyway mare ke ba tla o share re lona mehleng ya rona e apartheid ne rena le maburu 
a lukileng ke batla ho polantate Jan Scholz, Bob Riley, John Rogers le ba bang ba bangata. Ke sentse ke tshidisa le ba shwetsweng ya shwetsweng lo feta ke nna ke la ka shola ke morati wa ka Sam Phillips ke COVID. Empa he ke la ke iphumula vele vele mo ha se ha bo rona re ba edi. So re ba lokolle ho ba ba plekeng e bete re ba ha bo bona le modimo. Engwe ha peta ba ke batlang le jo tsa yona la mwana winning jaba jo loka ha aretse ditse di so pitseng. Nda to ha e hloka etse 2 weeks days ago. Joale he ka nne to rike a mo lebohela ho ba ne in show biz ho twe the show must go on. Eh bulang di tsebe he listen carefully ke tlo bua se go wa Joale. In a rike le lefung la my favorite favorite theater director Lucille Lucille Gillard. Ba bang ba lona ba motseba. Ho bo ho balwa. Ntwe ke neng ke ngole I'm talking about 20 years ago. Mari ila dula mo. Perhaps the most important of all is a sense of responsibility. In the final analysis, it may be the only thing that prevents total violence and nihilism in the world. It's the connective tissue between the individual and a tribe. It is the way people stay sane when they do stay sane. Responsibility to others keeps us from spinning off into insanity, which is, after all, total loneliness, total disconnection from others. Joali, hake batle mo twanse gari, black tax, black tax. Rebat, we lift as we rise. Ke lebo wa di tlape se no salo na tse li di tlape ang ekare. Langhatisa, tlape ang en minute. Hoba cha, banaba bizuang di celebrit. Banaba, kusang lenzu leno. We are all celebrities. Mutwa kunuma kandijana. Mutwa atli nang toilet. Ke celebrity. Mewaka. Ke batla lufa manjwa mewaka. Unari. Ntwa ngule ngwe oye. Zangwa nakali haiba wa fiela. U fiela kasela ye mutwa atla fita mwono. Abatla hu tseba. Ene ke lebo wa me aitwa bali leka khoto ban. Ki iswara le seka mantwa no. Ki atseba lan rata ka ufela. Ka baka lang le naki ale rata. Ene ki yuko kube di setabe ahu reke la jante ki yuko wakalon. Naki tseba ke chwana le mutwe mwono le emong. Ki ale rata. Jwale, me Elizabeth Sirunye. Haki ki anamu wana ki ite kufa award. Gwale ki tlao ya me laka nitle umpe enflopo ba. Ni ki laka di twista. Mama, before Zamaya, I think we should all stand up as I hand this award to you because... No, in chapel, Sister Bettina. Mama, you are one of the most important women in the industry. Coming from my heart, I remember the first time I had my first, first, first lead gig and you acted against me and you said to me, Gerata, the way you act on that thing, we're not all last up because of more to. And I heard exactly that in your speech today. My acting, my presenting, everything I do with an industry is a job and need to treat it with respect. So from all of your children, thank you, ma'am. Still to come, a tribute performance by Ratabile Kumalo, plus more winners celebrated in the Royalty Soapy Awards 2021. Lead roles categories. Stay tuned. This posture has been an extremely difficult one, globally, but particularly in our industry. Many of us have lost loved ones. 
It's been unspeakably tough to navigate the grief of losing beloved family, friends, and colleagues during this pandemic. But we choose to honor them. The lives they lived with passion and enthusiasm and the legacy of their work. Not a day goes by where we don't miss them and wish they were here. Tonight, we celebrate these amazing, talented artists who are gone too soon.
And may all the fallen stars rest in power. Their names are forever enshrined in our hearts. We've also just learned of the sad passing of the father of the founder of the Royal Tisopia Awards. Uh, Winnie Chaba's uh, father is now with the Lord. Sad news indeed, but like we said earlier on, the show must go on. We love your strength, Mama. Today we're meeting with the villains. Dum, 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 dum. <laughs> villains don't take taxis, man. You lose, you lose those privileges. Oh. You also lose the privilege of being greeted, you know? When, when, when you say hello at the grocery store, you sometimes come across a mm. <laughs> and that's as good as you get. That's Your as bag good as it gets. You even get an mm. Sometimes I, you just get a... It's been uh, 12 years now. It's a, it's a journey, hey? And of those 12 years, I think I've been bad for about six and good for about six. And to play a villain, I must say, is just fantastic. I love it. Oh, it's dirty. It's <laughs> evil. It's I was wicked. That. It's <laughs> nasty. But really good. I'm enjoying it. It's so yeah. juicy. Mm, yeah. What a trip. What a trip. There is something so exhilarating about playing a villain, where you get to tap out of the prim and the proper, and you get to dig really deep. The next category is my personal favorite. <laughs> it's those delicious villains we all love to hate. <laughs> to present the awards for outstanding male and female villains, please welcome Jamie Butler and Zola Nobona. <laughs> Oh yeah, oh yeah. I guess I'm getting this from my touch. This is just the time to grab and get a feel of a new game, but now don't you dare double cross these female villains. <coughs> Zola looks very, very special and extraordinary this evening. I would not dare, because I value my, my skin and bones too much. These five actresses have created magnificent characters uh, that are truly formidable and sometimes downright scary. <laughs> These are the nominees for Outstanding Female Villain. Kia Betre, Motelaniane, as Le City Molloy, Sylvan Delon, and guess who we with it? No one. Elsa Kling, as Dorothy Gallant, Aaron's Flay. And Mark and his year, me. Mustanos Makar. Mobi de Sipamla, as Togo Zile to Magute. In Bill. I'm Anza Ute. Musuki Bulal, Abulale Wayne, and Gangan Mepo, Masanga Poise. Mushiti Mutehwa as Sarah in Isono. To go through her children to get to my Jessica Ngozi as Tando Sibata in The Queen. I have to do this for my family. And Ayanda Bandla as Lake Amon in Upetina Wetu. Just how useless Demnan and Betty are once and for all. Niafunu was bang bang. Can you be an answer? And you bath, you guys. And the winner is Jessica Ngozi as Tando Sibata in The Queen. Um, but thank you so much to the Royalty Soapy Awards. Thank you, Siswini. Thank you so much to my family at home, all my siblings, my cousins, Wonko Muntekaya, my partner, my daughter, No Andoake. Um, thank you so much to Ferguson Films, um, to everyone from the office, the crew, the whole cast. I know we've had a tough, tough year. But he always comes through for us. 
Um, thank you so much to Mrs. Connie Ferguson, and thank you so much as well to Mr. Shauna Ferguson. I want to dedicate this award to him. He gave me a chance to play my first villain role. So thank you, Gakulu, and Ngiabonga Gakulu, guys, for this. Thank you to everyone who also watches the show. We appreciate it. Having dived into the odd villain here and there myself, I know how complex they can be. Uh, you're not just a baddie. You know, you're, you're the baddie who's also charming and loving and... Manipulative and bad <laughs> Yes, all of the above. And all of those things and, of course, much, much more. The nominees for Outstanding Male Villain are... Dirk Stolz as the Venperson, Sylvan Dillon. Eric Holm as Rian Malarbe, Bina Landers. Ntutuzi Mabaso as Nketeza Keteza, Deep City. Yes, I hate one. Without the permission, yeah. Vusi Kunene as Jack Mabaso, Generations The Legacy. Jack Devna Ryan as Sunil Maharaj in Imbe. Don't make me become the destroyer of your life, Shriya. And Emmanuel Castes as Manny Antonopoulos in Isono. Get the guns, but we're going on a trip. I tell you, on this one's tight. I can feel it in my water. <laughs> And the winner of this award tonight. Vusi Kanani has checked my boss of the generations. The winner. To remind us, we don't do this just in jail to put a meal on the table. <laughs> this is our life. In the city and our song. And Gitelu Bonga, Utogotela, Umfundi Vunja. Uh, you created a legacy. Thank you very much for allowing me to be part of it, and thank you for this role, Jack. Uh, you know, a lot of people don't even know my real name. They all call me Jack. But thank you so much. Thank you, thank you so, so, so much. And thank you, South Africa. Thank you for the love. Let's get naked! Still to come, a never-seen-before collaboration by SA's top performers. Plus, find out who takes home the coveted lead actor and actress trophies. Stay tuned. So, we've got our own way. We shouldn't compare ourselves with America because they have US dollar. We've got ways and... Some of us here are from community theater and we're hoying. So it's about realizing that as, as an artist from here, that, you know, we match up with the best of the best. People always say you're an actress. I say now I'm a storyteller. Yeah. Nothing storytelling is storytelling. It doesn't matter whether it's from this tip of the world or whether it's there. The conventions and Brav you told me this said nobody owns a convention. We must just find a way of adding our voice. I better change my mind. Oh. I better change my mind. You know, there's a this thing that you get when you're performing, this mm. feeling inside, and it makes you so happy. I didn't know exactly what I was supposed to be doing, but I knew that if I'm on stage, people would be clapping. Popular friends and lovers, she got the gun. I was like... 
Thank you. This is a masterclass. This is this is There are only three more awards this evening: the coveted lead actor and actress awards, and the prestigious outstanding daily TV drama. Our next presenters are dynamic duo. She has graced our screens and generations, Isidingo, and also a popular singer. Please make some noise for my favorite, my girlfriend, Latoya Makena. Hey. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Every one of the actresses nom nominated tonight have raised the bar when it comes to exceptional performances. The talent, depth, and skill of their performances have moved us and kept us glued to our TV screens. Here are the nominees for Outstanding Lead Actress. Hilda Hart White as Bonita Pessoa, Sylvia Dillard. Nompo Melelo Vilagazi as Nea Guala in Deep City. Katle Khotange as Tati in Gomorra Season 2. In Tati Mushesh as Mary Lovu in Isolo. Lusan Dambani as Boniswa Langa in Scandal. And Shoki Mola as Celia in Scheme Sub. And the winner is... Lusan Dambani! <laughs> to my creator, the one who gives me the talent, thank you. To the ones who walk with me, who walk ahead of me, who shine the light for me and open doors for me. Ni lendo go to the ancestors, ani ambe di zala, ni zvuni ancestors, ni zonga na yoni sebenzi le. Thank you, thank you, my people. To my family who supports me unconditionally and just lets me be. Team ETV, Team Okra Media, Team Scandal, and to the viewers who have taken the Boniswa character and elevated it to heights I could never have imagined. Nizis Koko Bantubam, and I use Koko Nje, Nizis Koko Zebiza. Thank you so much. Thank you to the Royal Sea Soapy Awards. Thank you so much. Yes, Emmanuel, ever the gentleman. Oh, uh, you know. <laughs> I do. <laughs> so, the lead actors nominated tonight are incredible performers and masters of their craft. They have created characters that are real, authentic, and compelling. Here are the nominees for Outstanding Lead Actor. Hamilton Lamini as Bonga Jele in Deep City. <laughs> Ayanda Taweti as Tumani Langa in Scandal. Africa Tuwai as John Maputla in Skim Sab. Aubrey Po as Castro Kamanga in The Estate. Temba Ndaba as Brutus Corsa in The Queen. And Maso Jam Caesar as Nkunzi in Uzalo. <laughs> and the winner is. Ah. My brother Aubrey Paul as Castron Kamanga.
God is good all the time. This is for every actor that takes it seriously. Every single one of you, new and old, that are in this industry, for all of you who take it seriously, this is for you. Secondly, to an equitable industry in our lifetime. Every single bill that sits in front of parliament uh, or cabinet must be signed soon so that we can see our livelihoods that we deserve in our lifetime. Amanda? Um, to the team at, at S3, uh, Pat and the team, uh, Dichaba, my brother, Nirvana, um, everybody at S3, Team CMP, Clive, Lala, my brother, Dom, thank you for the trust. To the writers, Chisanga, congratulations, and thank you for, for putting on paper a character that I enjoy and go to a happy place every time. To my mother, to my loved ones, my entire family, to my fellow nominees in this character, in, in this category, the young ones, welcome, welcome, we'll see you at work. Ndosh, my fellow, my fellow nominees in this, in this category, this goes out to you. To everybody, Amanda. <laughs>
You know, you guys are the best in the country right now. Trust it. I always tell them every single day you're the best in the country, and it's proven. This is it, Deep City number one. Obviously, um, Zanti Magic for giving us the opportunity. My fellow colleagues in the industry, thank you very much. I can't, I can't wait to see you guys on set. And uh, obviously, um, my producer, right here, the youngest line producer in the country. <laughs> Obviously, my partners, Anali, Mbomi. Thank you very much for this. Thank you. And uh, Esan, all the musicians, because it's obviously the music that carries the pulse of Deep City. So, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations to all the winners and continue to shine like stars that you are. That's a wrap for this year's Royalty Sophie Awards. Thank you to every single artist in, in the television industry for your dedication, for your commitment in creating amazing work. Deep City! <laughs> oh, we celebrate people like you tonight and shine! <laughs> And now it's time for everyone to get up on your feet and put on your dancing shoes. Yes, even you at home. And now a collab like no other, an electric performance by Makati and Mafigi Zola. Love you and good night.
Thank you. Have a great night. Are we?